Hey YouTube, aka Soggy Buns here, and welcome to this Let's Play. In this Let's Play, we're gonna play City Skylines. Um, I've played City Skylines a little bit so far on Steam. I have around 40 hours logged. I thought I played a little bit. I thought I played more than that, but apparently I haven't. So, basically, what I want to do in this Let's Play is I want to test my skills and more um, specific. I want to see how to make roads the most effective that I can. Um, with this, yeah, we can use uh, transport like metro, bus lines, airport, ferry, especially with this map. This map's got quite a bit of rivers and the good thing is too about these rivers is there's a couple couple channels to use to get around and yeah so also in this let's play what I've done is I got a few mods enabled some of those mods are uh, r traffic president so I'll be able to uh, manage my roads micromanage the roads the way that I want to um, I have quite a bit of assets unlocked in forms of buildings because um, you know we want to make some cool looking uh, sections of the city and that's another thing that I find myself doing when I play city skylines is I pretty much just uh, now nilly deli just place things here and there and just zone things here and there um, especially just the convenience of just growing the population or just growing money so another mod that I have enabled is just unlimited money so we're just gonna be able to just build the infrastructure of the city um, we can place down some of these you, you know uh, pre-built mods and unlocked uh, sections of the city I have another mod enabled which is move it um, so I'll be able to combine sections of the city, move things and props. So try, try to make things a little bit more uh, prettier, more beautiful. I, what I want to do is I want to be more particular about this because sometimes my game style is just let's just build, 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 see, let's just fill in, fill in, fill in. And this one I do want to fill in as much as I can um, by having you know the population gridded pretty well and that reminds me I actually have another mod that is uh, called realistic population and what that does is like more common here in the US there's only usually about one or two households per house within uh, low density um, suburban areas in the country and so what this mod does is what it does is it, it basically only makes it so there's only one or two households per house so it makes it so more houses are built so it makes it your city look a lot more dense so that should be pretty cool and it also kinda does the same thing with like the more um, dense uh, urban residential areas is the way the mod works is per floor is basically it's one family per floor so if you have a 10 10 story building what it tries to do is put about 8 to 10 families in that build in that building if you have a 20 it you know tries to do about 15 to 20 and it also does that for office spaces and commercial zoning as well it tries to make make it so you know um, you have you know a big skyscraper it's a more risk that more realistic uh, set of companies and employees that are in there so that will be kind of neat to see to see how that works so I think what we're going to do first is just so that we can get all of our population uh, planned we are just gonna purchase all of the tiles that we can and I think I have a mod enabled where I can purchase 25 uh, tiles so we're just gonna I mean we got the money for it. we're just gonna we're just gonna purchase everything we can um, and we'll kind of we'll be a little strategic about it about where we want to go. We probably there's probably plenty of ocean front for us. I think these would be kind of interesting to go more inland so we got more property. But another thing that I want to do is I want to kind of make it more of a modern feeling city with more high tech buildings. Kind of something that you might would find in 
San Francisco or uh, Seattle, something like that. So I think I can go ahead. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. Five. Yeah, I can purchase all of these. So I'm just going to purchase all of these. Um, so go ahead and do that. And then after I do that, we'll take a look and see where our our inlets and outlets are for the city, uh, the main freeway. Um, we'll kind of look and see the see if we go out this way, we go out that way. Um, I can I can see there's a city uh, highway here, highway there. So we'll look at that. We'll we'll look at um, kind of. So is this a rail? Yeah, railroad. And it looks like we could put a highway down here, come down that that coastline a little bit, follow the river there. Yeah, I really, yeah, this should be pretty interesting. Kind of have a Seattle feel or San Francisco feel is kind of what I'm going for. Oh, look at this. This is kind of cool, this waterfall here. Could definitely look into building a dam right here. Um, hopefully not have a waterfall come down right on this side but actually that might not be too bad it'll just go on the river so yeah that's good a good source of power right there uh, oh a nice area we could build a nice touristy leisure area around here oh yeah another thing I wanted to mention I don't really have too many DLCs downloaded I don't even know if I have any DLCs downloaded with this one just a bunch of mods so it's kind of a vanilla fill but I mean at the same time it's not because I got so many mods so but we'll see how it goes um, -da 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 -da. yeah I mean this is kinda cool I mean I guess this kinda have this doesn't really have like a San Francisco or a Seattle feel maybe more of a Seattle feel because of the dense woods and there's that kind of that rainforest it's it's a kind of for rainforest up in Seattle um, it kind of makes you feel like it's more of a European just the way I don't know that's kind of the feel I get but we'll make it into a United a US uh, city or county um, I thought we had I mean there's not really a huge huge amount of land to build on so we're gonna really have to pack it in there I mean maybe out here down here or maybe over here we could do a little bit of um, not low density uh, population especially with these mountains here this lake is kinda cool I think that would be cool to build a dam there who knows we might even just do that first and then because I just really want to focus on infrastructure and just really plan it out try to make it as efficient as possible but I mean it doesn't really matter where that's another thing about when I play City Skylines um, I usually put so much infrastructure down that I usually just lose money we don't really care in this this one huh this would be kind of interesting and I wonder if I need to build up I think that's the right way for the water to flow. See if this will even fill up. Oh yeah, it's filling up. And I built the dam low enough. I mean, it won't it's not a very huge dam, so I don't know how much power will actually generate, but um I mean currently right now nothing because we're not filled up but might be a source of a power generation I mean if needed to we could landscape this and just make this huge actually I can't really because it's right up the the line but well, we'll see we'll see how that goes who knows maybe I need to move the dam over a little bit um, are we actually drain, draining the dam
Well, we'll see. We'll let that do its thing. It's that's kind of early on. Um, I do like this waterfall. That's kind of cool. So we'll come back to that. Um, let's see. Where's our main highway? Because I only saw the railroad. I don't even think we have one. Which that might be kind of an interesting uh, plot twist. I didn't even didn't even realize that. This is, I did forget to mention, this is a, a Steam Workshop map. I mean, now with the railroads, this really feels like Europe. <laughs> or early America, but let's see. Are these all just railroads? I did not even realize that when I chose this map. I think the the creator of the map was going to put in a freeway right here, but they just didn't. Anyways, yeah, this is from from the workshop, so that might be a... Uh, oh, look, they even have... Yep, like a castle and a graveyard right here. <laughs> so, I mean, yeah, not really the United States, but we'll make it work. So it looks like what we're going to have to do is really take advantage of these cruise ships. Yeah. These cruise ships and these rail lines. We're going to have to get some passenger cars and some airports in. Which is really interesting. Really interesting. But that's fine. We'll make it work. So. Huh. Hopefully I haven't made you sick by all my scrolling. So I guess what we need to do is decide how we're going to connect the city and start getting some resources, how we're going to manage with our pumping our water, getting rid of our water. Um, So the water is going inland, and then it looks like it, oh, interesting. Is it all coming in, inland? So the water is coming in. Does it follow out? Water's coming in. Oh, interesting. We're going to have some interesting sewage issues too. I did not even consider any of this when I picked this map, but that's all right. Make the fun more, the game more interesting. So we're going to have to figure something out for that too. Okay. There's our dam. It's a big water source. All right. Maybe we'll come back to that. So that one's a freight terminal, cargo train, train station. Allows tourists to travel to and from the city. Place the station to connect it. Okay. And then simple in inner metro. And there are bus stations. All right. So. Then we got these cruise lines, which you know honestly might be our best bet. So, but we got a couple of these buildings here. Um, oh, my bad.
must be like some old mine right here. I wonder if I can delete these. I can. Yeah, we'll just take that one out. Da, da, da. All right, this is gonna be kind of interesting because I think what I wanna do is start kind of over here. So let's just check in our dam real quick. So it looks like, it looks like it, no, everything's still flowing. Is this dam even working? I don't even know if the dam's working. Uh, we'll, we'll revisit that. So anyways, let's do what we're gonna do. We put in this terminal. I don't really, let's move it. Actually haven't really used it that much. Yeah, let's do a four lane four lane road with the trees. I think that will match our scenery here and let's turn this off for now. Four lane road. Okay. Looks kind of cool actually. And let's let's make a connection to the railroad and then we'll start building the highway. I think what we'll do is we'll just build a highway running along this side of the border. I even have a huge bridge right here. Connect connect it up to the the railroad. So yeah, let's go ahead, let's do that.